Repair Clinic encourages you to perform this procedure safely. In this video, we will show one or more of these icons to alert you when to use caution. Before you replace the water inlet valve in your washer, unplug the power cord and shut off the water supply. Now use a Phillips head screwdriver to unthread the screws securing the rear control panel. Lift the panel up to remove. Next, detach the control housing. Remove the hot and cold water supply lines from the inlet valve. Be prepared for some water to spill out. Note the orientation of the wires connected to the valve, then disconnect them. Next, release the retaining clamps securing the hoses to the valve and pull the hoses off. Remove the mounting screws securing the valve to the control base. Lift the old valve and pull it free of the dispenser assembly. You're now ready to install the new water inlet valve. Insert the nozzles into the ports on the dispenser assembly and replace the mounting screws. Attach the hoses to the new valve and secure them with the retaining clamps. Connect the wires to the appropriate terminals on the new valve. Attach the hot and cold water supply lines. Reposition the control housing. Slide the rear control panel into place and secure it with the screws. With the repair completed, turn the water supply back on, plug the power cord back in, and your washer should be ready for use.